That is such a good. Oh my, what? I mean, Jordan, no. Oh my god. I just got run through there. Just because they don't want me to score a hand trick, I just got completely f***ed up. How did the defender. Oh my god. That is mental. I am shook. All right, so last episode was the lowest that we can go in this series. I hope it doesn't get much worse than last episode. We didn't win a lot of matches and then we lost a very important match against Bayern Munich. But that is just for the team though. Look at this. Right now, Zan is on track to match Bundesliga's long-standing goal record. Could we see a new benchmark set come the end of the season? We're just at the beginning of the season though, if you guys think about it. We are just in October. So there's every possibility that we can actually beat that i don't know what it is but i think kane beat it last year i'm not sure if he did or not but i think we actually do have what it takes to beat it but right now we don't have bundesliga action we're taking a break from bundesliga we have two really important matches one against netherlands and the other one is against argentina as you can see here but after that we have frankfurt we have um the champions league match against Brest. then we <laughs> oh my god then we have Werder bremen and a couple other matches i don't know we're probably going to end the episode in this match against liverpool or we might end it simulating this one against Bochum, Bochum, and heidenheim probably that's how we might end the episode but anyways if you enjoyed these videos make sure to hit the like button and also subscribe to my channel if you haven't already subscribed all right so we have 29 skill points available something i'm still not going to touch until i feel like i need to touch it but we have the match against Netherlands and I swear to God, if this match doesn't go well, if this particular match doesn't go well, I am not going to play like as just Zan in the playable highlights again. I'm always going to use like the full team just for the playable highlights though. Alright, complete one pass. That's what I'm going to enhance. Our last international match actually ended really well. We got a hat trick against a juggernaut in Europe like Portugal. So that was really good. But now we have a solo run and this is actually looking to be um a good start to the match but let's hope that we can actually all right the defender fucked up there can we score yes we can definitely and that is the first goal of the match let's go with the rasmus celebration exactly that was actually such a good finish to think about it but now we have another solo run and how do i get past this defender okay that was that was brilliant again again exactly the the exact same thing happened twice let's go to the freaking camera and now we are okay what the hell's going on all right yeah we are two goals ahead of netherlands and it's just 28 minutes into the match so that is a really good start to this episode and now we have another german and now we have a counter attack but i don't think i should run straight off the bat here exactly it wasn't i wasn't confident that they were going to like make that pass very well exactly what i'm talking about Oh shit, that was offside. Crap, 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 crap. I took too much time there. Corner kick. Let's hope that Netherlands doesn't actually get like a goal after this. Because that's going to really, really suck. But let's whip this into the... Nice. And that is a good save from the Dutch keeper. Alright, still 2-1. We have a counter-attack. This is a really, really good chance. And I think this is going to be our hat-trick. Another hat-trick. Oh my god, no, 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 oh my god, I'm so fucking stupid. I'm so fucking stupid with that. I was not thinking. I don't know what the hell I was thinking, but I mean, we still have a really good chance for a hat trick. We have to get this because I feel like Netherlands is going to get a goal if, if we're not careful. They still haven't gotten a goal, so we're still, we're still pretty lucky here. We have one more chance to score, one more chance to score. I cannot believe that. I cannot believe that I actually flunks that all right okay get it into him uh please play back oh shit that's fucking upside come on all right so please tell me it's two one all right so two one that's good so we got a brace in this match we're lucky there because we had two really good chances to score and for some reason i was <laughs> I was being really, really overconfident in that last solo run that we had. But I mean, 
lucky us we still grab the win in this match all right so next up we have the match against argentina i'm not going to play this one i'm not going to play the full match of this one as well because it is also a friendly match but i think we have something to do with halloween we're going to be spending halloween in the gym because we are so fucking hard working oh we actually got something on social media for that did i just meet zan at my local gym i hope that wasn't his doppelganger oh that's actually really cool <laughs> I mean, but I think that's the only scenario they have for that. So it's probably going to get old really fast. Right now, we have the match against um, Argentina. The last one went really well. I don't think Messi is going to be playing. He probably will be, though, because, I mean, it's freaking Messi. And he's, like, still a... He's still 88, but he's at 75. I don't know if he's still that high. He should still be that high. I mean, it's freaking Messi for God's sake. Get a match rating of 6.5. Complete one pass and score at least one goal. I'm going to enhance the one with the passes. That's the one that, you know gets me thinking less let's hope it's it's going to be as easy a match as the one against netherlands world all right so we have a counter attack but it's not going to go as planned for sure oh shit what the hell is that the guy legit just left the ball he legit just left the freaking ball that is crazy all right crossing opportunities for Jeremy, and we are the ones with the ball here okay please work ah shit that would have been so good if he got the shot on work on beqm what the hell is that all right, so we have a chance for a counter. Let's take it out wide. That is good. Okay. No, why did you do that? But anyways, we have a solo run. And this might be... I don't know how I want to get past this defender. Oh my god, I did the wrong skill. I did the wrong freaking skill. Please, get it back to me. Thank you. Oh no, I just... I just... I just controlled it for the freaking defender. Yeah, we're actually like fucking up. That is why we haven't scored yet. Because I feel like... If I did the right skill to get past that defender, I probably would have, you know, gotten a goal there. But the wrong thing came up. All right, they have already scored. So we possibly are going to lose this match if we do not score here. So this is, um... Exactly. All right, so that's the end of the match. And they have won 2-0. It was my fault. I didn't really get, like, clear court scenarios like that. So I don't want to give excuses, but it was my fault. But... Anyway, it's a 2-0 loss. So I remember that the first scenario, we had a really good counter-attack and the ball just went into where I don't even understand at all. Make it promise to the fans, we know we let you down, but the team will come back stronger next time. That's what I'm going to go for because we are the virtuoso of life, man. So next up, we have Frankfurt in the Bundesliga. Our Frankfurt is currently second, so this is going to be a tough match. I'm going to play the full thing, but let me look at the calendar real quick we have the match against breast next i'm going to play the highlights for that then we have Werder bremen all right i think i know what i'm going to do so i'm going to play the full match of this and i'm probably going to simulate the next um bundesliga match so frankfurt is a relatively good side so let's hope that the team actually has what it takes to get a win against them they're not going to be as good as bayern were but i feel like we should be able to do something in this match and get a win have a dribble success rate of at least 30 percent that's what i'm going to be enhancing and we are starting this match. Frankfurt is going to be the ones kicking off live from the Bay Arena. And well, let's hope that we can get a good result here. Okay. Please score it. Please score it. Oh my god, that is such a good, a good way to set up the goal. But I mean, they just weren't able to get a goal there. Why would he score that? Alright, we are lucky there. We're probably going to get a goal. Thank you, and that is the first goal of the match by Conrad Zahn Jr. And that is such a good goal. Our hustle play is honestly so unbelievable because this is the second time that that is happening where we lose possession, but we get it back immediately, and then we get ourselves a really good goal. So that is 1-0 to Bayer Leverkusen. All right, I'm really hoping the defense doesn't do something absolutely stupid here like they always do. They literally always do something stupid. So, all right, that is good from Jonathan Ta, but they still have the ball here. Let's try and... Oh my god. I mean, just get the fucking ball from him. I swear to god, if they score after all this, I'm going to be so pissed. I'm going to be so pissed if they score after all of this. Alright, that is a good interception. Please just get the ball out. Thank you. Alright, they're looking dangerous here again, but Jonathan Tau, I believe in you. Alright, so we have the ball here. Let's get this to Hoffman. And please score it. Don't even think of not scoring it. Don't score it. This is the second time I'm giving him the ball. A really, really good ball. But he was being so slow for some reason. I have no idea why he was being so bloody slow there. But. Oh well. Alright, what can I do here? Brilliant. Oh my god, that is beautiful. That is fucking beautiful from Conrad. Oh my god. 
Oh my god. He got past one defender and then he got past three defenders. All in one fluid movement. Raw. That was actually that is actually has to be that actually that actually has to be one of the best goals I've scored this season. That is such a good goal. Immediately shot right up to 9.3 after that, because that was that was brilliant. Alright, the defender got done there, but Jonathan Tar is there once again to help us out. Please don't even try to fuck this up. Oh my god. Oh my god, these guys are trying to give me a fucking headache right now. But the defenders did really well yet again. Alright, just go past. Brilliant. Pass it. Oh my god, that is such a bad pass. Why, why did he pass it like that? Alright, defense is doing really well. I'm beginning to believe in them. But now that I've said that, they're probably going to score because, okay, that's still good. That is still good enough. No, alright, that is a good block. And we come off with the ball and, you know, it's giving away, like, immediately. That is another good block. And it goes out. Okay, it doesn't go out. If I just play it away, please don't even try me. Oh my god. That's exactly what they did in the last episode. What? What the hell did you do there? Why didn't you just fucking pass it? Why did you go back? I was in such a good position. Alright, that's a good pass. Let's see if we can get our hat trick. Maybe. Oh my god, keeper just saved it. That is so unlucky. That is so unlucky. We still haven't gotten our professional hat trick though. The one we have is just in the international friendlies and doesn't really count in the grand scheme of things, even though I'm counting it. But I still want a professional one. And that is. That should be good. Please score it. Thank you. And that is yet another assist for Conrad Zahn Jr. Finally, Hoffman scores. Finally, and now it's half time and we completely demolished Frankfurt in this match. I don't know why we are so good all of a sudden. I don't know what this incredible source of morale the team is getting is, but that is that has been a really, really good first half. Okay, oh my god. That is such a good oh my, what? What? I mean you're no my god. Oh my fucking god. I just got run through there. Just because they don't want me to score a hand trick, I just got completely fucked up. And I was planning on getting some down right there. Oh my god. How did the defender Oh my god? That is mental. <laughs> oh my god. I am shook. Alright, so we're ending that match. We're simulating the rest of it. I need to see how bad that injury is, cause alright, so we did win it 4 2. Flora Grits got the final goal for our team. I'm actually I'm actually quite shook that the defenders actually went that far to stop me. Zan's head wasn't in the Are you fucking kidding me? New email from Peter. Oh my god, we are out for Oh my god, we are out for five months. We are out for five freaking months. I don't even know what the fuck to do here. Cause this is crazy. This I was not expecting this at all. I was not expecting this at all. In our first season, where it was looking like we're possibly going to get a lot of individual awards along with beating the Bundesliga record. That's what now happens. On the plus side though, with that we have gotten all the way up to fifth in the Bundesliga. Dortmund, I still don't understand what the hell they're doing. They're still wait, where is Dortmund? Oh Dortmund has shot up to six. Alright, that's good for them. So we're not going to be playing for the next five months. I really hope that Leverkusen can actually make it to the knockout stages so that I will still be in the Champions League when I'm back. But I mean we're going to be simulating till five months from now. So I'm going to do four months just to be safe. So one, two, three, four. So we're going to be gone till February. Let's just take it to the last day in January to January 30th and let's see what exactly happens that is actually mental all right it's December 23rd and we are still injured but our birthday if I'm not wrong is December 17th so it has already passed I actually forgot about it I'm going to be doing book a nightclub and get invited out to everyone to every celebrity you know a party with the ones you love um I think I'm going to do this for now that's heartbeats so 40 heartbeat points for that it's still very surreal that we actually got injured the year comes close to an end but it's not an excuse to rest for zan who recently showed up at the local school to help a fundraiser i don't think that's about my birthday though you know what's crazi i just noticed this matches in the starting exile is dropping it used to be like 100 percent before but it's dropping really really fast because i haven't been playing any matches at all 
I don't think that would be fair if they're counting that. Right, we have gotten to the 30th of January and we are still injured. I still don't know when it shows when I would return, to be honest. It said five months, but I skipped just four months. So I think I might possibly just um simulate the whole thing again till we get to the end of of february so i'm going to simulate to the 28th of february and let's hope that we can actually get the win i'm not going to be continuing the episode once we like get back from being injured i'm going to stop it there i want to be like be realistic and then we like make a very big comeback in the next episode but the dfb pokal we do win it against leipzig um we're almost at the end of february and we are still injured what the hell do i need to do oh okay so we could have just gone to squad home all this time oh my god i didn't know that there was a squad home i never actually saw it but it's in my actions so now we have 13 days left to go if i saw that right yeah exactly 13 days so i'm just going to count it real quick 10 11 12 13 all right so we're going to the 16th of the month that is after the matches against atalanta let's hope that we actually do make it to oh my god they, they beat us in the first leg oh my god this is going to be bad i want to play champions league knockout football please tell me that we actually make it past them in the second leg please tell me we actually do we're playing away from home this is going to be fucking dangerous i think we won it shit we did not win it we lost we're out of the champions league we're out of the fucking champions league guys it says injured but it it has taken my manager rating all the way back up to where it was. So I don't know what the issue is. But we have a German match in a couple of days. Alright, so we're actually second. Bayern is in first. They are just three points ahead of us. So, I mean, we can still catch up to them though. And also, what are the odds that we get knocked out in the Champions League by the team that defeated Leverkusen in the Europa League last season in the finals? That is just crazy so i mean we have like some massive vendetta against them this thing looking very very scary now so i just need to make sure that we play really well in all the matches from now on and hopefully we can actually secure our contract for leverkusen next season but in the next episode we have the match against Zed republic that's what we're going to be starting and then we also have um new zealand so i mean th those should be relatively easy matches we should coast through them easily and now that i think about it i also didn't check if we are still in the german league that's the DFB Pokal. We're still in it. We're in the semi-finals. We're going up against Dortmund and Bayern is going against FC Ingolstadt. Anyways, all that's important right now is to try our hardest to win the DFB Pokal and the Bundesliga because we're out of the Champions League. It really would have been fun to get the treble, especially after the season that Leverkusen had last season. But anyways, this is the end of the video. If you have enjoyed it, make sure to hit the like button and also subscribe to my channel. Sorry it was cut short, but I couldn't do anything about the injury. I never saw it coming. But I want to like try and remain realistic here. So I just skipped to the end of the term of the injury. We're going to be coming back stronger. I tell you that the injury is not going to get us down. So anyways, thank you for watching once again. And I'll see you in my next video. Peace.